how's it going guys? This is Dave 2D and I never thought I'd do a video on hard drives, let alone external hard drives because that's some pretty boring shit. But in my search for trying to find a faster workstation for video edits, I discovered some really interesting things about external hard drives. So I thought I'd share it with you guys. Here it is. So the first thing we need to talk about is who really needs a fast external drive. I mean, faster drives are always nice, but there comes a point where it's not really worth paying money for a drive that you're just gonna use for the occasional backup. But there are some cases where you would really benefit from a fast external drive, and one of these is when you do video editing, because having just one drive for video edits is really bad. It doesn't matter how awesome your computer is, if you're only using one drive, you're gonna stunt your workflow a lot. The reasoning is that if you're working on a video, you're gonna be reading and writing a lot of data at once. And so if you have one drive, it has to do all the reading and all the writing at the same time. So that's not a good thing. And to make matters worse, if you're on a notebook, you can't really add internal storage. So currently in terms of affordable or just inexpensive external drives, there's only several options. There's USB 2 drives, which top out at around 40 megabytes per second. And there's USB 3 drives, which you can set up in RAID, but usually you can only get about 150 megabytes per second with those. And there are Thunderbolt and Firewire options, but those are pretty expensive and quite frankly, not that much faster. But the cool thing I found are these USB 3 drives with something called UASP, which stands for USB Attached SCSI Protocol. And that just has acronyms within acronyms. But to make it short, the drives with UASP are amazing. You can easily get 400 megabytes per second on read and write. So you get yourself an SSD, like a Crucial MX100 or something, and you pick up a UASP enclosure, and you basically have hard drive speeds as fast as a in regular internal SSD. So for me, my render times improved about five or 10%. Nothing crazy, but it's still nice. But the biggest improvement is during editing. So ever since switching over to an external drive that has UASP to store my media files, like the raw footage, previewing in 4K doesn't have any stutter anymore. So if you're just getting into video editing and you're using a notebook like I am, get one of these things, your workflow will be so much faster. Now having an external drive like this isn't only for video editing. The same thing applies to photo editing or even games. You can store all your games onto a drive with UASP and it will run as fast or potentially faster than if you installed it onto your main boot drive. That's just how fast these drives are. And if you wanna take it to the next level for portability, instead of using a full UASP enclosure, I actually purchased a couple of these UASP enabled cables and these guys just plug directly into your hard drive. So if you have a pair of these cables, you leave one of these cables at work and then you have another one at home and whenever you want, you just unplug your drive and bring it around with you. It's pretty awesome. So hopefully you guys learned a thing or two from that. I tried to keep the video short just because it's hard drives, right? But if you liked it, give me some thumbs and if you loved it, give me some subs. It's been nice, I'll see you guys next time.